Christian Horner led Red Bull to the F1 Constructors' Championship title this season. Christian Horner reportedly rejected a move to Ferrari because there are too many egos at the Italian outfit. Horner guided Red Bull to their first Constructors' Championship for almost a decade this year, while his star driver Max Verstappen tasted glory for the second consecutive year season in the Drivers' Championship. According to the Daily Mail, Horner was approached by Ferrari to take over from Mattia Bonato, who resigned at the end of last month. The Scuderia were keen to take him away from Red Bull as they looked to return to the pinnacle of F1. But the 49-year-old had no intention of hopping ship after 17 years at Red Bull, and a source close to the discussions told the publication, there is too much politics below the surface at Ferrari. Too many egos. If someone starts succeeding, someone else pulls him down. Horner's refusal to link up with Ferrari left the pathway clear for Frenchman Frederic Vasseur to take the top job at the team's Marinello HQ. The 54-year-old, who is the current boss of Alfa Romeo, will replace Bonato on 9 January. Last week, Red Bull company air Mark Mateschitz jetted over to the team's factory in Milton Keynes to plan for the future alongside Horner. Mateschitz, 30, has inherited his father Dietrich's £25 billion fortune following the death of the Red Bull co-founder in October. Horner's refusal to work for Ferrari will come as a bitter blow to the once-dominant team. The former Formula 3000 driver was appointed to oversee the Red Bull F1 team by Mateschitz in 2005 when the energy drink giant decided to enter the sport for the first time. The Briton had previously experienced vast success after founding the Arden International Race Team. Horner has been instrumental in Red Bull's rise to the top of F1, with his team winning four consecutive team titles between 2010 and 2013 and Sebastian Vettel getting his hands on four individual championships for the outfit during the same period. After a spell of Mercedes dominance, Horner managed to oversee a Verstappen masterclass last year as the Dutchman finally landed his maiden championship after getting the better of Lewis Hamilton at the season deciding Abu Dhabi Grand Prix as the race ended in controversy. And Horner enabled the superstar driver to back up his success with a second championship this time around as the ace wrapped up the title at the Japanese Grand Prix with four races remaining.